this particular playlist we're going to be looking at a few examples of solving linear equations. These are a little bit more difficult than some of the others in the previous playlist and they're aimed at uh, probably around about grade B which is about a level 6 at GCSE. So we're going to start with a fairly straightforward one and then work our way through to um, equations which are a little bit more challenging. Okay this particular one uh, we've got a denominator of 4 and we're going to be asked to find the value of W of this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply both sides by 4 because if I do that this denominator of 4 gets cancelled out because effectively I've got 4 times that divided by 4 so one cancels the other out and on the left hand side I end up with 25 minus 3w equals 10 times 4 which is 40. Okay, so it's looking a little bit easier to deal with now. And really we need to be in a position where we get the value that incorporates the W on the left hand side in this case and the numbers on the right hand side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to minus 25 from both sides. And again, if I minus 25 from both sides, it means I lose this value here and I get left with minus 3w. And I've got then 40 minus 25, which is going to be 15. Now, at this point, it should give you some degree of confidence because... 3 divides into 15 is a whole number. Now I'm not suggesting that you're always going to get a whole number as a solution, but um, generally speaking when you get to this point the maths itself or the arithmetic itself is relatively straightforward. So what we're going to do is divide through by minus 3. Because again, if I divide by minus 3, this becomes minus 3 divided by minus 3, which is a positive value, which is 1 of w. And on this side, I've got divided by minus 3. Well, 15 divided by 3 is 5, but it's a negative number. A positive divided by a negative is going to be a negative value of 5. And that would answer this particular question. I hope that's okay for you. Please do add a comment below. Uh, there is another playlist on linear equations as well you can have a look at. These are the more tricky, more challenging ones. And it started off fairly straightforward. And then we'll build through to uh, something that's a little bit harder towards the end. Okay, I look forward to seeing you inside the next video. Thank you.